In this tutorial, we're going to show you how to invite others to your event. Each event allows you the opportunity to invite others to attend the same event. If you're holding a meeting or having a friendly get-together, you can send an invitation to the event through the event creator and keep track of the RSVPs in the same interface. To invite someone to your event, just follow these steps. If you're creating a new event, go ahead and click on Create. So let's click on Create and make a PTO meeting, Parent Teacher Organization meeting. And we'll make this a repeating event um, beginning on Wednesday the 7th at 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. And we're going to make this happen every two weeks on Wednesdays. And we're going to say never. We're going to let it run indefinitely until we stop running the event and click on done. So now I have my repeating parent teacher organization meeting scheduled and I would like to invite the other members on the PTO. So I can go ahead and do that by typing in their email addresses or their names if they're in my contacts. And I'll just add one more. Okay. Now I've added and I'm going to invite these people and hopefully they will respond that they are attending my meeting. When I save the event, I'll be prompted to send the invitation. So I'm going to click send. And that invitation has been sent and I have a reoccurring event. If I want to know if anybody has RSVP'd, I simply click on the event and click on edit and I can go and see who has responded yes, maybe, or no. Nobody's responded yet. So let's give them a moment to respond and then we'll go back in and look and see what that looks like. Okay, now I've had a little time to wait for replies. Let's see if anybody has responded to my invitation to the event. So I'm going to go ahead and edit the event. And here I can see that Carlene Pennywell, myself, and Max Wazinski are both attending, and I'm still waiting to hear from the others. And that's okay. But that's how you can manage your invites and RSVPs through your Google Calendar invitations. If the recipient of the invitation does not use Google Calendar or have a Google account, they can still view the details of the event and RSVP accordingly. Go ahead and create an event. So let's go ahead and create an event. So go ahead now and create an event and invite somebody to your event. 